Touchless water tap In today's time, sharing the water tap, or using a public water tap, is very dangerous. This may help to spread the virus. Touchless infrared sensor taps, allows a completely new way of washing the hands. It senses, when your hands are approaching the water tap, and it automatically activates the flow of water. If no movement detected by the sensor, then water jet will automatically turn off. You no need to rotate the knob of water tap to turn it on or off. These are the components, which are needed in this project. LM358 Comparator IC 8 pin IC base 310 kilo ohm resistors 2 1 kilo ohm resistors 210 microfarad electrolytic capacitors 1 red LED 7805 voltage regulator BC547 NPN transistor 5 volt water pump 1 IR pair 9 volt battery PP3 battery connector on off rocker switch 1 0 PCB 4 screw with nuts and 4 plastic spacers before making the project, we will understand its circuit diagram. We are using a 9 volt battery, to power up the circuit, this is an on-off switch, which is used to start or stop the project, LED is used to give power on indication, and 1 kilo ohm current limiting resistor is used, to protect the LED, from over voltage and current, 7805 voltage regulator is used to convert 9 volt DC, into fixed 5 volt DC, while we use the circuit, the battery starts discharging, and battery voltage starts decreasing, but 7805 maintains fixed 5 volt DC, at its output, unless the battery voltage goes below 7 volt, two capacitors of 10 microfarad are used, at the input and output of 7805, to avoid any fluctuations in the supply. LM358, is an 8-pin dual comparator IC, it compares two of its inputs, and give the output accordingly, comparator compares the signal, at its pin number 2, with the signal at pin number 3, and give the output at its pin number 1, when the voltage at pin number 2, is higher than the voltage at pin number 3, then it gives a low output, at pin number 1, when voltage at pin number 2, is less than the voltage at pin number 3, then it gives a high output, at pin number 1, 2 10 kilo ohm resistors, are used in potential divider mode, and they gives 2.5 volt, at pin number 2 of the comparator. This is the symbol of IR LED, and this is the symbol of photodiode. When we put our hands in front of IR pair, then IR rays falls on the photodiode, so photodiode turns on, and connects the pin number 3 of IC, with the positive supply. Now, comparator has 2.5 volt at pin number 2, and 5 volt at pin number 3, so it gives a high signal, at its pin number 1. Base terminal of NPN transistor, is connected with pin number 1 of IC. When transistor turns on, it provides the ground supply to the water pump, and water pump turns on, so till the hands are in front of the sensor, the pump keeps on. When there is no hand in front of the sensor, then no IR rays falls on the photodiode, and photodiode turns off. Now pin number 3 disconnects with a positive supply, and this 10 kilo ohm resistor, gives the ground signal to pin number 3. Now in this case, comparator has 2.5 volt at pin number 2, and 0 volt at pin number 3, so it gives a low signal, at its pin number 1. When transistor gets a low signal at its base terminal, then it turns off, and cuts the ground supply of water pump, so till there is no hand in front of the sensor, the pump keeps off. These are the components, which we will use, to make our project. First of all, we will make a PCB base, and for that, we will take a zero PCB, 
and make a hole at each of its corner. Now, we will insert a 1 inch screw inside the hole. Now we will take a plastic spacer and then we will use a nut to lock the spacer. Now our PCB base is ready. To switch on or off our project we will use an on off switch. We need to make a big hole to fit this switch on the PCB. To protect the LED from high voltage and current, we will use a 1 kilo ohm current limiting resistor. We will solder a power indication LED on the PCB. Now we will solder the 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. Small pin of the capacitor is negative and long pin is positive. Now we will solder 7805 voltage regulator. It has three pins. First one is input pin, second one is ground pin and third pin is output pin. Now we will solder the 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. Now we will solder the 8 pin IC base. Now we will solder the IR LED. Remember that the flat side is negative and round side is positive. Green sleeves are used to avoid the sorting between its two terminals. Now we will solder the 1 kilo ohm resistor. Now we will solder the photodiode. Connect the flat side of photodiode with the positive supply terminal and round side with the 10 kilo ohm resistor. Green sleeves are used to avoid the shorting between its two pins. Now we will solder the 10 kilo ohm resistor. Now we will solder two 10 kilo ohm resistors one by one to make the voltage divider.
Now we will solder the 1 kilo ohm resistor. Now we will solder the transistor. There are 3 pins in a transistor. Pin 1 is called collector, 2 is called base and 3 is called emitter. Now we will mount it on the PCB. Now we will connect the water pump. Now we will solder the PP3 battery connector. Connect the red wire with the positive terminal, and black wire with the negative terminal in the circuit. Now we will insert the LM358IC, in the 8-pin IC socket. Now we will connect a 9 volt battery, and test our project. When we put our hands in front of the sensor, then IR rays will reflect from our hands, and received by the photo sensor. After sensing the hand, water pump will turn on, and supply the water. When we take our hands away from the tap, then pump will turn off. Our circuit is working perfectly. I hope you enjoyed the video, and learned something from it. For any help or to clear your doubts, regarding your project, you can contact us on our student care number, 7007957715. To buy the items used in this project, you can visit our website, www.eraltech.com. You can give us the orders on WhatsApp also. Thank you so much.